Smart Cell has uh, over 150,000 zero mode waveguides. Um, it's standard wafer manufacturing. This is uh, lithography on a glass substrate. And these zero mode waveguides, they create this detection volume at the bottom, which is like the smallest um, volume possible. And what happens is the, the um, the wavelength, the, uh, the light wavelength, is much, much larger than, than the size or the diameter of, of the smart cell itself. So light's only allowed to penetrate just through the very bottom of the zero mode waveguide. And so that's where we anchor the enzyme to sit. And we're watching across over 150,000 zero mode waveguides the enzyme while it's incorporating these bases. That's the enzyme. That bottom of the zero mode waveguide, we actually put a, a coating on there of a particular uh, sets of molecules which the enzyme wants to stick to and that's what anchors it at the bottom. And then the nucleotides float around in suspension with their different fluorophores attached to it. And as the enzyme is going through its sequencing process, in suspension it's going to grab one of these nucleotides and in the process of pulling it together and attaching it, it's going to hold that uh, fluorophore close to the bottom in the detectable area for a longer period of time we can watch that with the cameras, and then once it's done, it drops off the fluorophore, but to go back into suspension, we no longer have that signal, and we can then, processing it through our algorithms, make the base call. And that's, in a nutshell, what we do that makes us very unique, is, is that we can do this real time. These uh, enzymes run at about um, two and a half, on average, nucleotides uh, per second, is how fast we go. And then based on that, we might run two to three hour movies for, for a given smart cell run. And then I think it's just going to kind of zoom out and show you how we package it. So. Could you talk about that more? Um, what, what exactly is happening? I saw the nucleotides going in there and then doing something and then leaving. Is that right? Or? So the nucleotides.